This video ends with Margit dies, by the way. Hey guys, uh, I'm going to literally play Chin Champ, the soul level 1 wretch, with a club and a short or small shield, rather, and use parry, something that I'm absolutely horrible, about, uh, horrible with in the Dark Souls games. I've played through all of Elden Ring in this wooden kitchen chair on my freaking, my, my, uh, my kitchen table. I used four Switch games to prop up my laptop. I'll show them off here. True MVPs that got me through 90 hours of gameplay there. We have Super Mario Party, really good game. I haven't played it, but we have the Carnival games. This is pretty good. Uh, Pikmin 3, played all the way through that. And then Smash Bros, unlocked every hero on that. And they've served me well. My laptop has not overheated, and it's been great. Elden Ring is probably the best game I've ever played in my entire life so good that I'm going to actually literally waste eight hour eight and a half hours here trying to kill Margot probably actually the hardest boss in the game played through on my boy Griff here ended with the fucking um, Melania Falcon helmet which I was using the prisoner helmet the whole time uh, that was it was really amazing I actually I like explored so much I, I, I don't know this was, this was just literally the best game ever. So I immediately went and made a mage, and then I immediately went and made this guy. So that will tell you how much I like mage gameplay in this game. Um, I just really like being up and close and really punching the shit out of these people. I actually upgraded... Wow, <laughs> alright, that shows what I've been doing. Um, upgraded this quite a bit. I like remember where everything is. So I remember where the Radagon's uh, source seal is. That gives you plus five, all the good stats. None of that stupid ass magic shit. The amount of magic I actually used while playing this game was actually really cool because of the Ash Awards. I got this way earlier than I did in my actual playthrough. And I still don't even really know where I got it. Boost faith. I'm so happy because I'm using a faith weapon. Not. So this is as far as like the plus two stones could take my club. And if you guys see in the freaking top right there, uh, literally level one so this is what retards do when they beat the game and they have nothing else they spend way too long in the character customization oh yeah that's really something else right there so yeah i can see the resemblance my friends were saying that's the the average white or caucasian build and i couldn't agree more it kind of looks like me on a uh, on a good day but anyways we're literally just gonna sit here I might not even talk for long periods of time because like I said I'm there's nothing I'm worse at than uh, parrying I'm actually just fucking horrible at it and I didn't want to kill this guy without recording it because I thought it would be so cool to have it as a video so I'm showing off literally the worst attempt I've ever had on him I'm gonna I, I, I'm going to freak out. What's going on? I can't hit anything. I actually... I actually almost killed him earlier, by the way, from doing this. Literally a retardation. Watch. There we go. That's what we're used to. He's such a bitch. Get the fuck out of here. So this is why... You know, I wish you could just hit him off the edge there, but... It is what it is. Aw. Like I said, I can't. So, yeah. So, like, this game's really good. And I love this game. And you know how I can I tell you how much I love this game? Like, I haven't slept a full night's sleep since it came out. This thing, I've, I've full degen on it. And I can't say I've done that much for any game. It was, like, literally, like, World of Warcraft Classic was the last... Last game I really fucking went full goblin mode on. And now we really are goblin moding. So this attempt we're actually going to do something. I'm not going to talk. Watch. Told you. I told you. If I just don't talk, we'll be fine. I'm just so good. I'm just so good. He's gonna die and this video is gonna be actually over pretty quick.
fucking bitch. Now he's gonna hammer. Now we have to bait phase one attacks. That's crucial. I could. I could actually just have done that. I could also parry that move. Instead, I think I'll throw. Run. Because he'll do that. The second he whips out the sword, you just have to get away from him. And he normally does it when he does the charge thing. There we go. There we go. Alright, we're just going to end this video real quick here. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, I'm not dead. Fuck yes. Yes, dude. Holy shit. Best attempt yet. Just back off. That's not backing off. I'm such an idiot. I got him down to his name. Oh, he's so dead, guys. He's so dead. He's so dead. I I couldn't kill him. So I literally had him down to, like, the G. And I could have, like, just clubbed him down. But I, uh, I'll be honest. I just... I, I want this shit up on my YouTube channel. Like, this is the most dumb shit I've ever done in my life. What else are you going to do at 1 in the morning on a Saturday during the school year? You know, like, this is the time that I need to forget all the things I've learned this week. I just, you know, everyone hates school. Everyone hates college. It just sucks. And Elden Ring's amazing for just, you know, just having fun and just beating the shit out of something like this. Just this big fucking antler bitch head. Fuck you. Oh, I fucked it up. That's alright. Back out. Bitch. Bitch. I see people like fight like the hardest bosses in the game like this. If I ever get to any of them, I will, uh, oh, is he gonna hammer this one? I will, I will probably record them, too. Now he's gonna hammer swing for shit. What? Oh, I'm such a, I'm, I'm a really bad player. I'm a really good player. I think my friend uh, started the game as a wretch. Like, first playthrough. Run. See, that's what I meant by run. You can freaking parry that, but I never have success. I did successfully once. So why did I go in there and try to attack him? I don't know. I thought I could do it again. Cheers. Some seltzer water. Whenever I make a video on this channel, I really just want to do it to capture a moment. And uh, just talk. And, you know, I'm 20 now. Probably my last video, I wasn't 20. And, uh, yeah, I always think it's cool to have a, a channel like this that I was a kid. I was I mean, I 8 or so, maybe 10. 8 or 10 when I I first started uploading on this, and I, I, I'm really happy that I still have like the passwords and all the memories. So I try to. Uh, I'm gonna stop being sentimental here, but what I'm trying to say is, I find it very important to, uh, to keep, to keep it up to date. I'm dead. Wow. To keep it up to date, to make a video at least like once a year, it's kind of like uh, those people that do like, oh, I took a photo of myself uh, once a day for uh, 10 years or so, and they do like a time lapse. But for me, it's once a year, and it's in video form yet. And it was why I decided to actually do it on camera today. I actually didn't really want to. Run. 
God, I'm so good. There's no way I'm not doing that. Oh. I don't think he's done that in a while. No. It's just done. It's just done. Okay. Good thing I'm retarded. Yes, keep doing these super easy attacks like that. Don't do ones that like I haven't seen in like, you know, since I actually first loaded up the game. Jesus. Good. Well, I only have a 50% heal now, so. We're dead. Good. Whenever he uses the sword and you're close, you're basically dead. Yeah, there's really nothing you do about that. So that's always fun. This is the first boss in the game, by the way. But you all know that I uh, have not played this game. Should you play this game? Yes. Let me show you everywhere I've been. And I haven't beaten the first boss in the game. That's right. You can basically go anywhere in this game at any point. This is not really the first boss in the game, but let's just say if you fight the boss that's somewhere over here, named General Radon or whatever, you're not going to be level appropriate, but you can do all this shit at level 1. I'm not even supposed to be level 1 fighting this guy. Like This guy, what is it, like 20, 30? I don't know. I think 30 or so. You don't want to fight this guy. I thought I can use like the Bloodhound Sword, so don't ask me. I actually used so many weapons. That was one thing I really liked about Blood uh, Bloodborne. I actually want to play Bloodborne one day, but I'm not. I don't own a gay station. Um, it's one of those things where uh, I'm just gonna jump off the cliff. I think. No, never give up on an attempt. Do it. Swing. I was pissed. I'm dead. So I actually... So the funny thing is, is the best shield to block with in this game is locked literally behind the gate that this guy's guarding. So I'm stuck with like a... kind of a dog-ass shield. And um... There's really not much I can do about it. Run. See what I mean? I'm. I fucking hate that sword. I I literally hate that sword. This guy. After I beat this guy, literally the rest of the game was a fucking joke. This guy is the wall. If you can get past this guy, literally you can beat the rest of the game. The rest of the game is not, not not even close to as hard as this guy. And people might say I'm actually just the biggest idiot in the world for saying that, but he's such a hard boss. Like, you need to know and do so much to actually beat him that, like, he basically prepares you for everything else this game throws at you. Bar magic, people, but he even prepares you a little bit for that with the daggers. Oh, thanks, Hammer, for not landing. I appreciate that. Yeah, the strategy really here, and especially in phase two, is just to bait out the attacks that he's doing right now. Like this one. Very good, very easy to hit. That one I should hit, but since I'm shit at this game, more shit at parrying. Yeah, come here. See, like that. Like, you can. Anything with his staff, you can easily just fucking hit. But any weird moves, it just. It's done. You're done when he starts doing weird boy stuff. I'm getting gamer chills. Alright, boys, video's over. And we're done.
I'm clenching. Is this it? Oh! oh. <laughs> Fucking ass stuff. I want you to know, other than like some of the easy bosses, like uh, like the wolf man and, and the cat, and like obviously some of the basic enemies, I, I in none of the other pre any of the previous other games I've ever parried anything. Like I, I've never killed a boss parrying. I, I can't parry. I, I've 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 never been able to do this. I I I'm actually shaking. And I like I said I've I've been in this game, but that was. That was a really long time on this box. That was a really long time. Oh, I can level up. I'm gonna. Oh, just kidding. I'm, I'm beating this run on, uh, on soul level one. I actually don't care. The goal here, actually, was uh, it's quite simple. Was to literally get to the guy who gives you the best blocking shield in the game, and you can literally only get it from this guy. So the video ends when we get to this guy, actually. So I'm making a little bit of an amendment. Oh, another one. Okay, good. This is the best. Um, this is this, the Halig Tree Dungeon, and the the capital is probably. Gondrix is good because how early on, like this is an explorer's game. If you like exploring, you really like just the world in general. You're gonna love this game. Come over here, would you? This guy's insane. He actually starts like stomping the boss's head at the end. It's, it's awesome. The guard, you'll breach the now the problem is, so there's two ways I can go about this. I can listen to him, go and fight Godric, and have to get to Godric, which I know how to get to him pretty quickly. And I have to do a bunch of things, and then he'll sell it to me, maybe. Or I go and use the main gate, try not to get killed by the huge army guarding it, and then drop in from the ceiling... And then I think he might sell to me. Fair enough. Well, if you must go through the gates, I'll signal them to open. But of course, I'd advise. I didn't know you could go back to this guy. I just knew that he uh, he went to the the final boss room. But yeah, apparently he gives you the best parrying shield. Now you can start off with the parrying shield, but as a wretch, you can't. It's only as a bandit. Oh God, I have. 12,000 souls. So there's a third option where you just kill this guy. And, uh... The guard. You'll slip. How do I ask that? When you it's only so can I open it and come back? The gates. Open the gates. Yeah, they're gonna shoot a bunch of shit at me. So later on, when you actually do the castle, you can come. You have to actually come. You don't have to. There's so many branching paths. Like you actually climb up on those. I'm pointing to the screen, like you can see. But kind of like right at the uh, the top of the doorway there. There's like that wall. Like you scale up the buildings and stuff, and you run across like the rafters. Gates are also in your neck. Damn it! I want him. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. I have way too much to lose. I can't lose this. Oh, shit. So, what I need to do is I need to. So, what I'm gonna do is it's literally to the left. I just have to get up that hill. I just have to make it up that ridge. This is literally some Saving Private Ryan D Day shit, alright? Oh, 
Okay, okay, okay. 12,000 souls, 12,000 souls. You get so much with that. All right. Oh, I'm dead. Uh, it's right here. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, did you see how close that was to my foot? What the fuck? Oh, look at my health. How much health do I have? How much health do I have? Five, I have five fucking health. I love this fucking game. This game is so good. Alright, now. Now he'll sell to you. I did it without killing him. Right? What? Someone said that's literally how it worked. Oh, I know what you have to do. I know what you have to do. It's super simple. It's super simple. Super simple. We got this. We got this. Oh, it was laundry. I was like, uh oh. Could this be lever? Yeah, it is. Oh, you don't have to fuck it. What's the point of your dog shit then? Oh. Call me a simple gerb. If I land on him. The gates are always only in your neck on the line. Well, when uh, when peace is not an option, it is literally just war. Oi, blast. What's it to you? Step back, you wretched tarnished. Get fucked, idiot. You should have just you just should have sold me your shit. I just wanted your shit. I literally I, You did you didn't deserve it. Alright, you didn't deserve it, but this character didn't deserve to look like this, and yet I made him this way. Alright, we're gonna get the buckler right here. We gotta try this out on someone real quick though. Oh shit. Alright, I feel kinda bad, but like I said, this is just a meme. This is a fucking meme. There's no way this guy's legit. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. I'll give a... Elden Ring has the best fucking character customization since a lot... Uh, what was it? What was it? Not Lost Ark. Fucking uh, Ark Survival Evolve. This is literally god tier... Uh, god tier fucking character customization and you can get worse than this this is just me putting out like the maximum of a few sliders any game with sliders you all know how that goes oh, bank shop. I'm really sorry dude so this is what we needed and he didn't sell it and I really don't know why he didn't but buckler apparently is just obscenely good for pairing and there's literally nothing better and I'm gonna be walking around with 10,000 souls on me so I don't know is something I can buy. That's really high crit. So it actually kind of works like you want weapons with good crit for uh, for your little that you can do to them. So it's like you go like pink, and then like I was hitting them with the club because I start off with a club. But critical damage is how much damage that uh, that thrust does. So this is actually very good. I don't know if I should use it, but um, it's basically, you don't have many stats at level one. So this neck piece I have lets me use just a few. Oh, I have two now. Oh, I guess I'll put on the HP one. I'll probably find something better. I'm trying to remember where there was one that was like, Light armor does more damage, and since I'm never going to equip the armor on this character, I might just do the club, because the club's a meme, but there are some good... Like, I used this a little bit. This was pretty cool. It's literally a parrying dagger that you can parry with. 
This one I just don't have stats for. Literally most things you don't have stats for. I used this because I thought it was so funny just like gut punching people after uh, shielding them. Yeah, buckler. Wow. Need buckler. Oh, you can dual shield in this game? How the hell does that work? Alright, I'll be next playthrough. I'll dual shield. Oh yeah, I completely forgot. He gives you an extra talisman slot. So now you get... Yeah, if I find, like, the light armor one and then, like, critical hits recover health, like, that one will be good. But, yeah, there's some really cool stuff in this game. All right, buckler. And does it come just with parry? Buckler parry. Interesting. So it's it's old thing. So, um, can I do anything? Does upgrading it actually help at all? Upgrading it, it looks like it just does, it ups the damage of it. So I don't know if it's like considered quote unquote cheating using other weapons. I like using other weapons in this game. So I might go back and buy that rapier. Because uh, I, I like just not uh, wasting this many souls on absolutely nothing. Like I, I'm just going to die out there and, you know, get nothing from this. Because I've basically bought out all the vendors for their, their smithing stones and stuff because I wanted them. Because I needed them to get the, the club to plus six. Because basically upgrading the weapon is the only way you get more damage. And I think they can go up to like plus 25. So bar that, you can't really do much else. So this was really good crit. A thousand. I can always take some stone sword keys unless there's some good weapons here that I think are cool. Uh, I feel like these are always cool because they let you do extra stuff in the game. So I think that's good. Answers request for summoning from hunters. When invaded, request to aid. Maybe I'll do some PvP on this character just for shits and giggles. And for other shits and giggles, I'll pop one rune and get the other one. This is turning into a let's play, by the way. I'm just gonna, I'm just actually just gonna keep going until I would normally just stop. So, if, you, if you're if you bored, no one's probably watching this. But if I'm watching it in like 10 years in the future, what's up, bro? Or if I have like kids and I show my kids this, what's up? And make sure you go and play this game right now if you haven't played it in a while. Because it's actually phenomenal. From like the soundtrack to the combat to literally everything character customization obviously oh. I just, it's all really cool stuff so i don't know if i should go to godric castle or just explore around the main reason i wanted to fight margaret was because of that buckler now that i have the buckler i can really do the entire game because that's the only way to get the shield um like what's a good challenge like i feel like going here let's go let's go to the mistwood get the quest from Blyde to go kill Bloodhound, and then go kill Bloodhound, because I bet you Bloodhound's parryable. So some mon some things are literally just atrocious monsters, and you can't you can't kill them or parry them. Rather, you can kill anything in this game, trust me. But you can't parry them. So there's only some things, like mainly things with a sword that are swinging at you, um, obviously. But things that aren't like freaking godly in size wow that's really good stuff gold gold tin shit thank god really happy thanks game crafting in this game is cool i'm glad they have crafting they've just like mounted like you couldn't jump in the other souls games you obviously couldn't mount up you couldn't really craft that much like the crafting's like huge upgrading is just cool ashes of war adds so much to the game Everything they did just adds so much. And uh, if anyone, you know, anyone's watching that, uh, that's, you know, oh, oh, graphics, oh, it looks like Dark Souls 3, and oh, oh, my PC studered, um, you know, I recommend clicking off because you're just an idiot. You're actually just retarded. And you're the reason why games suck. Oh, oh, we need to optimize it. It needs to look realistic. Oh, it needs this all. Ooh, it needs all this dumb shit instead of actually content, instead of actually good stuff. People, they're like, oh, oh, I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna make the game 
and you could see the pores in their face and oh, oh all this stuff. I played this game on my laptop. I sh I'm playing right now on my laptop. I'm not even recording right now. And this thing's running flawlessly. And it ran flawlessly the whole time. Literally only the tree sentinel fight, which ooh, maybe that's who will fight. Who goes there? This is probably the oh, coolest character. The bloody busybody. This isn't the coolest character. That was uh, to him you don't seem so that one girl with one arm. I'm looking for a man who goes by Daryl. That is not a man. Come and tell me if I can offer you. Darrowell is and in need of a fitting end to his tale. Okay. Yeah, so it's just that's BS. He's uh he's not a person. Or maybe he is, but really deformed. Um yeah, the, the NPC quest lines in this are great, and the amount of endings that I got the Ronnie ending, because I did the Ronnie quest line, no shit. But, um, it was, it was really good. I really liked it. It includes Blythe there. That was, it was very well done, and I like that it tied into the ending. I felt like for the first time ever, I actually got a good ending in a Souls game, and I didn't just, like, set the universe on fire or leave it in darkness. Actually, like, led it into, like, an age of prosperity. And I was like, all that from a side quest? Also, the side quests lead you to so many hidden zones and secret bosses, like, with cutscenes and everything. Like, really impressive stuff. Oh, you can summon Blight here? We don't use summons. We're not bitches. This guy is going to kill me, I want you to know. This guy is... I don't know how to parry his stuff. Oh. Uh oh. Like I said, I have not. I don't even know if it's possible. I don't even know if it's possible, boys. I don't know if it's fucking possible. Because he's, uh, he's a bit of a, a wacky boy. We're gonna give it a. If we can get one off, then I'll, I'll keep going on him. But if not, then we'll just have to two hand the, the club and club him. But, uh, let's freaking pop some liquid static and keep going. You ever, like, have urges for, like, just flat pizza? Not, like, thick or anything like that. Just, like, flat mall pizza. Well, we had that. It was so good. And it was, like, my parents and I were on just it was the perfect wavelength. We both just wanted just good, bad pizza. Okay, almost one shot. So this has got to be... Okay. Okay, boys, we can do it. Alright, alright, look at how much damage that did. This guy's a joke. <laughs> alright, okay, dude. Now that we know how it's done. He's not even that hard. He's gonna die. I, I'm gonna run out of bosses. Oh, oh Jesus! Just kill him, man. No, it has to be a parry kill. Why am I autistic? Why, why can't I just accept good kills? You know, it's not even bullshit if I, if I, if I did him like that. It's completely legitimate. I don't need a parry kill. I don't need one. Why am I doing this to myself? He's literally one tap away. Why do I do what I do? We're gonna put it all on the line here. That's it. It's over after this. First attempt, first attempt, you know, we work these things out, and, uh, you know, it, sometimes, uh, sometimes these things happen, but, um, 
you always get back up and you try again. So that was, uh, let's just do the boss. I'm not going to talk. I'm not going to be entertaining. I'm, I'm really just going to kill the boss. I, I don't care. I'm just going to kill the boss. So, um, yeah, like that pizza was very good and we don't have any more slices because today was the second night of having it and, you know, I really wish I had a slice right now or, um, something to slice with because I'm upset. Quite frankly, I'm very upset. I'm upset with myself. Upset with um, you know, it's this, it's this, it's this damn controller, really. If I'm being honest with you guys. Oh Jesus! Why did I do this to myself? I actually. I could have killed that guy there. What was I doing that was so good? What was I doing that was so good? I was parrying. I wasn't being an idiot. Like I said, I, I can't parry in these games. I, I've, I've never been able to. I, I just suck at it. I will say the buckler is just amazing, though. Like I probably would not have been able to do what I've done so far if it wasn't for that. Jesus Christ, his move is so weird. You know the drill. Fucking bitch. What the fuck? How do you do it? How did I do it? Bitch. Fuck you. It's possible. His moves are just so weird. He's such a weird moving thing. I just need to focus. Obviously. Boink. <laughs> Those things are cool too. I like these. Normally you can't summon in them, it must be because it's a quest line. They're normally like a little challenge mode thingies. Thanks. Nice. <laughs> Fun. So this is Elden Ring. <laughs> okay. I, I, like, obviously I can kill this boss. You guys need to understand I can kill this boss if I really wanted to. I'm just, uh, prolonging it. But, uh, you know. This time for sure. I ain't saying shit. I ain't saying shit. We're just killing the boss. Shit, you fucking bitch. Fuck you. 
No. Just, just fucking die. Take the parry. Fuck you. Why am I not hitting him? Yeah, come at me with a normal swing, please. Something I can... I'm dead. <laughs> Something normal. I'm dead. Actually dead. Huh? Huh? I'm dead. Such a parryable move for sure. And so ain't that. Probably that. Ah. I'm just dog shit, man. Yeah, I should have done it there. Great heal. That helped me a lot. It's that move there, I can parry. So, if he does that, which he doesn't do that every time he does the Bloodhound step, I can parry that. I just don't know when he's going to do that and do his other bullshit. But he did it that like four times in a row. But sometimes he just doesn't do that. He does something fucking else. He drags his claws or something. So, I just got to figure out. Like, is there a tell that he's going to swing into that? I don't know. Because you hit a shit ton on the parry hit on this guy. Like, way more than Margaret. Which is why this guy is completely doable. I love when that... Yeah, that hit there. That. Good heal. Yeah, I can parry that if I was a half decent player. Yeah, he just didn't do it there. Do it. That's what I mean. He doesn't do it half the time. He just doesn't do it. It's so fucking random. I'm actually molding. I'm molding. I'm molding. He's fucking random. He just like, uh, oh no, this time we're gonna do this. Like, what, what, what are you doing? He's just sliding on the ground like a fucking slink, man. Jesus. So, this is Elden Ring, by the way. No more mauling, no more. No more dumb shit. There's no more dumb shit. When can you get this hood off on it? That was easily parryable. Can you parry that? Yeah, like that. So when he does that, I feel like I can easily get that. Not even that hard. Oh, that's the special move. I feel like that. Definitely. Jesus. Alright. Alright, flat ground, brother. Come on. Fuck you. 
I hate that. You never heal now. Like, once you're behind once. Because I'm a retard, man. You know, if I just wasn't such an idiot, maybe I could do something, but... But I'm just stupid and bad at parrying. Like, I can't do anything, ever. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is a... This is a fun boss to parry. Because it's very easy tells on what he's about to do next. Jesus Christ. Also, his damage output is goddamn insane. Way the, more than Margaret's, I feel. Like, so hard to get actual attempts on what he's doing. Which is key when you're trying to figure out when you can attack or not. Which I can never attack. I can never attack. Why would I be able to attack? That's, <laughs> that would be funny. Actually, that would be a cool mechanic. Hitting a boss. But uh, we don't do that. We just die over and over and over and over. Jesus. Jesus. So I should have just ended it on Margaret. Let's be honest. <laughs> that was a really high high. And now I'm dying to this guy that I had on my second attempt. And I didn't want to kill because I wanted a parry kill. I'll let you guys know, if I get him down like that again, I'll fucking two-hand my weapon. Come on, do something stupid. That move, I feel like I've hit pretty well the past few times. Great. Great, I'm so happy, I'm so happy, I'm so happy. I'm not shaking out of anger. I might mu mute the music. I might mute the fucking music, boys. <laughs> this shit is so fucked. There's just something about staring at this white ass that just makes me want to keep going, all right? <sighs> gotta beat, gotta beat a certain attacks. Just gotta stand out of other shit. I should have done my thing there. Can you bit? Can you parry that? If I go and try to find out, I will die. I hit that every time. Very consistent on that. Very inconsistent on everything else. Like that move, I should be hitting that. I feel like... Good. I'm glad I'm getting worse. It's always a good feeling. But that happened. Seems like we got the damage out anyways, but was what we wanted. How does that not get parried? How do you parry that move? He does it all the time, and I hit it right when he gets out. I don't, I don't understand. How do you parry that move? Maybe it's impossible. It might actually be impossible. There's some moves that you actually can't parry. Hope you enjoy me mauling out. Like I said, every so often you just have to make a video and sometimes you just gotta put it up there. And you just gotta say what you gotta say. 
I like doing one at least, you know, at least once a year. Like, yo, I'm, I'm still alive. It's like, I want to stay close to him. Use your move, you fucking bitch. You see that? He teleported and then he just didn't do anything. Like, come here and use your move. Okay, great. I'm glad I didn't hit that one. I always did. Yeah, that one. That I literally hit every time. Alright. Why? It's so random. Literally random. Come here. Do it. Why? I don't understand why not. Why not? Why not hit it? Why not hit it? I, I, <laughs> what is what is what is what is the lose condition here? Why am I not hitting it? That's that's why I'm confused. Okay, why did I not hit that? I don't. Is this shield kind of sucky? <laughs> oh, I'm sucky. I, I actually don't know why I don't hit that. It's like very clear that I hit it. And it's been well in time. Yep, yep, great. I, I don't know why I don't hit that hit. I, 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 I'm, I'm really fucking confused. Like literally the swords clank. It's like... <laughs> and then I, it doesn't do anything. Ever. Now he does a second move after that. Maybe if I go in for that, I can hit him. Because the thing is, you have to like hit their hand, not their sword. So maybe I'm like, I'm at the tip of his sword, and he's just picking me off, and that's why I'm not getting any of these off. Oh, which is why I want to be close to him, but just die. You just die. You know? You just die over and over again. So this was literally me fighting Margaret for the first eight hours of this character. <laughs> literally me just doing it again. But on Margaret, I never had him at one health and then decided to throw for no reason. And that's probably why I'm pissed right now, because for whatever reason, he was super easy 10 minutes ago, and now he's impossible. Honest to God, can you hit any of your moves, man? Carrying is so fucking hard. Get fucked. Idiot. Nay. Nice. <laughs> I love parry only naked level one run. I don't know how I'm gonna beat like Melania or whatever, Blade of Makilla, or like Malekith or Radon. I literally any boss after this. I didn't think I was ever gonna beat Margot. Um but, but yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna do this. If I beat this guy by the end of this video, and I don't just turn off the camera, I'll, I'll be pretty happy. Yeah, nice hold on that attack. Okay. Yeah. Do it. Do something. Oh, he can block his claw off. Guess that's interesting. I'm gonna drink instead of hit. Good. Whoa. Oh, delay hit. I love parrying because I love spamming this, and your characters. Oh, I guess so. I'm so too. And not do what he's supposed to do. 
Jesus, man. Jesus. All right, so you can parry that claw move. That's good. So, yeah, you need to be close to parry. You can't fucking, uh... You can't be, like, touching, like, here. You have to be, like, here. You know what I mean? You have to be on him. And this guy does not want you to be on him. I love that move. Uh, I'm... <laughs> I'm not gonna hit myself. I, I'm surprised this controller is still... Because... I've gone this mad before, like, throughout the entire game, and I have just slammed this thing on my head, and I've bit in it, and I've done all sorts of degenerate stuff. Like I said, I don't, you don't put 90 hours in, in a rage game, and you don't rage. And this controller is really a champion. Um, to really no, show no wear and tear, no, like, mechanical dysfunction, it's, uh, it's pretty impressive. Like, I have really slammed this thing till I blacked out before. It's... It's crazy. And, um, yeah, it's just remained constant this whole time. I fall for that move every time. I'm, I'm always impressed with how stupid I am. I really am. It's always amazing. I, 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 I just actually kill me, actually, because I can't recover. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> like to see that I'm, I'm a fucking idiot. Yeah. That's very good. So this is why I like bad people at the game, like me. I'm not good at Souls games. I'm not good. I won't summon for a boss. I, I don't summon for boss, but... Will I, I will I go and level? Will I literally grind souls till I have enough strength and I'm fucking meeting the thing? Yes, I, I will. I have no regrets. I will grind. I'll get a good weapon. And yeah. Now that I actually have to have skill playing this game. I don't know what to do. If I do it instantly, it does nothing. If I don't do it instantly, I can't get it off in time. Maybe I just don't. I, I actually can't parry that move. I literally just have to bait out other attacks. Uh, that's what I'm going to do. I, I can't. I can't hit that. It, it looks like you can. It's a simple... Uh, but you, you can't do anything. You can't do anything with that move. I'm not parrying that move. I'm just going to keep rolling because I can roll out of it just fine. I literally just have to bait the claw or his like slight jump attack. Anything other than that, just keep your distance. That's it. This is just going to be an endurance fight. It's going to be super boring. I'm gonna stop talking right now. We're just going to get it done. Ah, oh, I should have done that. Oh, I'm going to kill myself. Thanks, tree. Thank you. Oh, thanks. Oh, I'm crouching. Oh. Oh, there's a lot of openings. Like that one.
anual This is, a, this is the exact type of gameplay you're going to get from me. I will spend way too long on one fight, waiting for the one opening. This is how I killed Radon. I just waited for him to do one attack. Well, and this normally happened. Alright. I feel like I can definitely parry that one, but I haven't tried it. Funny man, the funny man is funny. Hey, use that running attack. I feel like he hasn't used that once. I'm gonna try to parry that the next time he does it. Just because even I know that this is going on way too much for a video. And, yeah. I really love endurance fights. I love uh, fights that you can't do anything and there's no openings for uh, your playstyle. Fun. Now time to sit here for another 20 minutes. While I, I stare blankly at my screen, miserable, because I cannot parry Blood Knight Darwell. Hitting this thing. I missed. That's really bad. That's a bad omen. That's a fell omen right there. Should have stuck to the premise. Video ends when fell mo omen dies. And uh, I didn't. And now we're all suffering the consequences of this. Can you do that when he's going up? Or is it any time during that slice? Fuck me. How stupid am I? Very. Also very lucky. Wow, he did that jump twice. He did not none last attempt. Yeah, that's not variable, I'll tell you that much. Oh, I should have buried. I should parry this. I know. What am I doing? I, I'm so stupid sometimes. I, I, I really want to know what my IQ is. I want to take an IQ test to see how goddamn low it is. I am curious. I don't think I'm at I'm that high IQ. I'm very stupid. I'm not as dumb as this idiot. I'm going to fucking murder you. Do I throw again? I think I do. <laughs> and I and I got cocky. And I got cocky. And I got cocky. I love this game. I love this game. I love this game. Love this game. Oh my god, it's so good. And that's why this game's good. And that's why this game's good, because you have these really low lows, but higher highs, man. And every time, it's just like, it is freaking depression to freaking dopamine. It's so good. So good. Oh, man. I can't believe I did that. So it was the claw, man. It wasn't even the jump attack. The jump attack was good, but the claw, he did that way more consistently, way easier right. to parry. Yeah. Anyone trying to do that. Not to work for it, but it's done. Yeah. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. What does he give me again? Wow, that's pretty good. Oh yes. If you venture north to Rayukar, yes. the quest line. Tell him I sent you to be sure to treat you right. I owe you one, I reckon. Yes, and that guy's a legend as well. That's enough chit chat for this time you parted way. Alright, brother. You're very cool, you're very epic. Alright. Forlone hound ever go down. Nice. I'm so happy about that. Um, yeah, I actually really like this game. 
no matter how pissed I get, it's always about, it's not, I'm not mad at the game. I'm always mad at me because I know I can kill the boss and then I, I do something stupid. You know what I mean? I, I just do something dumb like, oh, oop, I tried to parry and I didn't. And it's like, but I had like so many attempts before where, I, oh, I parried it, I parried it. And it's like that. It's like when you yourself are the problem and you failed, it just feels horrible because it's not the game's fault. It's not anything's fault. It's literally your fault. Now, when it's the controller's fault, that's when you go. <laughs> or, but you don't do that just whenever. You only do that on occasion, right? Because otherwise, like, you know, I even do that gently now. It still hurts from all the other times. And it's like, you just gotta, uh, you gotta pace yourself, really. You gotta pace yourself on, uh, on your destructive habits. And really, a lot of these fights are actually pretty fun. I thought Margit was really fun. This guy was probably the hardest parry fight, purely because of just how weird his movements were. But I'm glad he's parryable, because a lot of the mobs aren't, because, like, you can't parry a bear, right? So I'm happy they did have it so you could parry him. Anything that I say when I'm molding out, don't listen to it because it's just bullshit. It's literally just me, just ego tripping. I'm better than this. I, I just beat the game. You know, I, I, I killed this guy so early on. I killed him with like, you know, a two-handed plus eight weapon. I was using Ashes of War weapon arts. I'm using no armor, level one, a club, and a fucking buckler. Like, and I think I'm that good. And I've never parried in any of these games ever, so. It's stuff like that. It's just me being dumb. I think that's fine. Am I able to use... No. Wow. Ouch. So. Oh, you know what we should have tried? We should have tried the freaking rape. We should try that. We should, um... I want to do at least one more. I want to try how much damage, like, 130 crit is in comparison to 100 because i don't know how much like 30 skills for damage so i have 1900 oh, i'm gonna do this really quick i'm gonna buy the torch and ray lucaria yeah 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 because there's a torch you can get and it's really useful because you just infinitely put it on your side and it lights up any dark spots lantern no oil no nothing 1800 perfect perfect a stock that doesn't have 130 so this is actually a really good the rapier is actually perfect yeah let's try that let's go find what's like a it's like a random boss that i can go do that's like a swordsman i don't even think you can can you parry crucible knight i i if i do crucible crucible knight that was a hard boss with the Bloodhound's Greatsword upgraded. That's how I, I beat him. And he was impossible. And I waited for two openings that he had. And it took me like, it was like a 15 minute fight. I don't want to do that. I'll be there till tomorrow night. Uh, so I'm trying to think of someone that's not that bad. Um, there's like Anchor Boy down here. I don't know if he's parryable. Is Mr. Leon. I can tell he's going to be horrible. He's super hyper aggro. There's a frost type of the guy that we just fought somewhere there. Not the exact type. He's actually way harder because he's more magey. Hmm. Hmm. I know there's like a catacombs here ish. Saints Bridge, huh? Was it there-ish, or was it there-ish? Somewhere. Just trying to think of random bosses. Erdtreed's parryable? Don't know. Don't really want to find out, I'll be honest. I mean, we can. I wish Margit was still alive. He was literally the best parry practice I've ever had in any of these games. And I don't really remember where all the mini-bosses are. This game's huge. Goes into the cloud walls, and there's underground. There's literally a sky level to this game. All this area here, and then so much under. There's like, there's basically 
this entire map, but underground. It's it's actually insane how much shit's underground. Good swords about bosses. Well, let's go. I'm actually going to go and see if Crucible Knight is indeed parryable. This is a horrible idea. Crucible Knight is the, one of the hardest bosses in this game. And uh, we're going to do it. I really just want to see the damage on it. I don't actually care about beating him. If we beat him, that's great. I just want to see how much damage this rapier is doing. I already tell that I don't like it compared to the slam that uh, that the freaking club does. And the club kind of fits my character more because that's like what you start with. That's always going to be like my main weapon, but I like trying. There's so many... Like, unlike Borderlands, where it's like, one million weapons, and there's like a slight variation to each, there's like one million weapons to this game, and they're like, all completely different. Like, this dagger is nothing like this dagger. This sword's nothing like this sword. This one's built for dismounting people off horses. This is a holy scythe. This is a spiked gloves. There's so much, like, cool stuff in this game. That's all unique. All right, let's see how the rapier is. For like any of the main bosses, I probably won't ever use. Oh, I don't. I won't ever say ever, but I like experimenting in this game with the weird stuff. All right, let's see if this guy can be parried. All right, that's a bad first start. Right. This was one of the hits that I'd get off on this guy. Oh, he can be. One seventy-eight to start. Oh, it's only one seventy-eight. Wait, this guy's easy. This guy is actually a joke, uh, when you compare him. What the fuck? He has the biggest tells ever. This is actually sad. Oh. Oh, oh. Wait, this is actually awesome. Yeah, I kind of like the, uh, the club way better. Because the club does like 300, but the club's also upgraded quite a bit, so maybe I should upgrade this if I have some spare. If I die to him, I'll probably go upgrade it. This is actually awesome. So this is how Perry's supposed to play, by the way. This is... I'm really good at the... We should have came to this guy first. Oh, I remember that. Uh-oh. Holy face. Is he gonna tail? Oh, why do I do what I do? This is a fight about being close. Getting ranged on this guy is just dumb. That's a good way to die. This is the best parry fight in the game. Completely broken if you parry. Alright, let's go, uh... Should I go use just the club? Because we'll have to actually travel a little bit. It's good damage. Like, the club is fully upgraded with the plus two, so... I don't know if it's completely fair. Also, that guy might have really chunky armor. Let's see what he's like with the club. And then we'll come back. And, uh... And we'll make a decision whether or not we want to um, go upgrade the rapier and see how much that 130 does in comparison to the club. It won't be exactly the same because I like kind of exhausted like all like the natural plus twos. There's some left. I'll probably be able to get it into the one of the two stones, but oh, that was a fuck up. That's okay. Actually, just kill me, because I can't recover, really. Yeah. I would have had to wait for that stomp, and let's be honest. Let's just... Let's just run it again. Maybe <laughs> you know what I mean. Let's just run it again. Sometimes you just have a bad start. That guy is a freaking joke when you're parrying him, though. You just get him in a chain, and he's done. I don't even remember what he dropped, so maybe he dropped something really good. I remember him being really tough, though. Like, he took me a lot of it. 
him and Margaret like so close to each other that I was like, what the fuck? This game's impossible. This is how the game's starting. All right, let's see here, 10. Ooh. All right, so even unupgraded, the rapier's still better. Yeah, let's go upgrade the rapier a little bit. Yeah, so 130's huge. Because even I'm up unupgraded, it's still way better than the uh, than the club baseline. So I have plenty of plus one, so we can go plus one at a bit. Yeah, let's go do that. Uh, we'll go take these souls. Oh yeah, that's that's really good. Fun, fun. See, and this is what I mean. You just go off and you start randomly doing stuff like this, and it's like, I don't know, it's just fun. Just so much random stuff. Like, this whole girl is like for weird spirit summons, and you get really into summons, but, you know, summons are for well, losers. You can't kill a boss. I'm gonna use summons. I use summons on repeats, because I thought that repeats were dumb. And um, I always gave like repeats a good chance, but if I just felt like it was stupid I, and I had already proven myself, I was like, I just don't care enough to sit here and die to this boss over and over again. What is this? Need one more smithing stone, one. I guess I can go. Where's this way I can go? Go here. Yeah, I guess I can go here. One more. I don't think I exhausted this place completely, but we'll see what happens. This place is a little higher level, so. Fuck you. I think we'll be all right. Oh yeah, there's stealth in this game too. Works very well, as you can see. Oh shit. Yeah. Holy shit. Worked for him. Jesus Christ. Drop ore? No. Some of the mobs drop ore. So I could go back to the earlier mine and just kill easy mobs. Or risk everything and fight harder mobs with a bunch of souls. Beautiful. Beautiful. I never cease to amaze myself. <laughs> I never cease to be fucking disappointed. I do one cool thing and I immediately fail somewhere else. Like that with everything. Yeah, alright, let's keep going. This is the longest video I've made in forever. I'm fine with it because I'm enjoying every second of it. Okay, I've never seen. I've played this entire game and I've never seen them do that. The headbutt I've seen, but the scream, never. Alright, let's just heal up now. I actually might, if, I, I don't, I don't want to say anything like, oh, I'll keep doing this, but I am having fun right now, but it's also because I just like Elden Ring. Okay. Oh, and this is why I love this game. But as you can see, stealth is working as intended. Jesus Christ. Be quiet. 
have to look for ore. It's fucking obvious where ore is. I kind of tapped this mine earlier. But I know I didn't take all of it. I know I didn't. There's even hidden paths. I don't know which way I went earlier. Those miners, they will drop smithing stone ones. I went this way. I know I did. I remember getting killed in there. That's why. Let's not run. Take it very slow. Not like these, these freaking sleeping peons. Alright, yep, stay asleep. What's going on down here? I hear a lot of bad noises up ahead. Someone else is crouching. There's a white ore there. That means it's a special ore, not what we need. We need a gold ore. Will I get detected? Should I just sprint by them? Yeah, what's over there? <laughs> A boss? I'm dead. See ya. I'm taking my chances with this guy. Oh, they left. I'm invincible. Wait, what? Who are you? I'm dead. I'm dead. This might be a good parry boss. Or I don't know if he's parryable, boys. <laughs> oh I don't know if he's parryable, boys. Um. So that might be minus 1800. Unless there's a Steak America down there. Alright, so, you know, every so often, you, you know, you get what you get, and then you... I can't teleport out. <sighs> Alright. Fuck you. Kill yourself. Oh, I'm doing good. It said weak foe ahead, but I didn't get to hear the recommendation. Oh, he is variable. We can do this. We can do this. Oh, we can do this. We can do this, boys. We can do this, boys. We can do this, boys. Go. <laughs> For the souls, for the souls. Fuck yes. Time to throw. I got him though. What is he doing? Schizo? I'm right here. Hey, use a normal attack. Use a normal attack. What the? I'm very upset. This guy's easy, though. Just because I, I fucked up everything because I'm an absolute idiot. Um, this guy is completely a joke. So I think what my problem is is that I try to parry when I'm far away. And um, 
you really just need to be up on the boss. If you're not up on the boss, then uh, you lost. I'm glad that you can just... Okay. Never mind. I was going to say, I was glad you just run through the boss uninterrupted and then uh, took an arrow to literally my anus. So. Oh, I wouldn't say my anus. That's some lower lumbar shit. Come here. And that was a beautiful, beautiful. All right. No mistakes. Fuck me. Am I retarded, man? I swear I actually have mental deficiencies. Alright, let's get up on him. Uh, like, why do I... Why do I make those mistakes? Just hit him. Like this. Like what I'm doing right now. I don't know why it's so hard for me to do this multiple times. Why? Why? Why am why am I stupid? I don't know why I'm stupid. I'm just dumb, and that's the problem. I'm I'm not a smart person. I'm I'm really just a highly functioning idiot. All right, that's really I want you guys to understand that I'm not smart at all. Um I just make dumb mistakes, and I continuously make dumb mistakes, and then finally I get things right, and that's basically all I can do, ever. It's what, every, every time I fight a boss, it's the same goddamn song and dance, where I screw something up, and, and I almost kill him in the first attempt. If this happened to me in my normal playthrough, I, I would uh, literally almost kill the boss, and then I would die. Like, my first attempt's the best. I'm not going to make any mistakes. You want to know why? Because I'm upset. I'm mad. And when I'm mad, I'm mad. Hold on to your attacks longer. Oh, shit. What? I see what I have to do though. I've recognized the pattern. I'm dialing in. I can't be stopped. I can't be stopped. Okay. I'm just gonna heal, cause we can. And I I'm dead, cause I made a dumb mistake. Why did I make the dumb mistake? God, God only knows. God only knows. I'm so upset. I don't know why. I timed that shit right when I've timed it before. And it doesn't work. I don't know why. I don't know why. It never works, man. This shit's so goddamn busted. It's insane. Alright, time to get hit by an archer or something because the game is funny. Oh ho ho! Almost got a Achilles heel there. All right, let's just just stay calm. You know, this is not a hard fight. We just we just kill him. Okay. Yeah. Great. Great. Good. That's very good. That's very good. Did I do anything cool today? Literally just trying to cope. <laughs> I am. I need a needle injection of copium. I am so bad. It's probably because it's now like 2.30. I'm now like half asleep. And uh, my reaction time is only getting slower from here. So, I mean, we're here 
I, I don't need to fight this boss. I have lost all my souls. He doesn't give he doesn't give stones. This mine's tap. I, I actually have no clue why I'm here right now. Other than I know he can be parried. Oh, I love that you do that now. And I'm dead. You want to know why? Because I can't. I'm done. I, I, I don't need to be here. I, 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 why am I here? Why am I here? Why am I in this dungeon? Why am I in this dungeon? I don't need to fight this guy. There's nothing telling me I need to fight this guy. I, he's not going to give me anything. He, he, I think he gives you an anchor. I, I, I literally don't need to be here. I'm not fighting him. I'm not fighting him. I'm, not, I'm done. I'm done. I'm going to give it one more shot. No talking. I need to be focused. Good. Why? What am I doing timing wise? That's wrong. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I, I, I'm I doing it and then it will work and I'll do it two or three times in a row and then it won't work. I, I, I'm, I'm not changing anything. I swear to God. I might as well grab this. I'm gonna get hit. I'm so goddamn done. I'm so goddamn done. I'm so done with this shit. I'm I'm die. I I am so mad. I'm so mad. I'm actually so mad. It's like I, I feel like I know what I'm doing right there. Fuck you. <sighs> All in a day's work, friends. It's really not that hard. It's actually hard being as good as I am. Let me get my souls. All right, plus zero. Zero times zero is still zero. And that place had absolutely nothing for me. Let's go to a way easier mine. And um, get actually what we need. Because there's just no point of being there. I'd <laughs> a waste of my time. But, uh, you know, I said... It's, Three in the morning, so um, it was either that or sleep. So I I think this is the better choice. So I don't think you can parry these guys. I've I've tried a million times. So we're just doing this and hope that one of them drops. I don't know how many smithing stone ones we need. Oh, is that why I'm gonna drop one? A pickaxe. Didn't know they could drop that. It's actually pretty cool. Blink. Wow. This is actually great. This is how you're meant to play the game. Look at these nuts. Get out of here, rats. Oh, nothing's down here. 
Good thing I bought those rats that I don't think have a drop chance of those at all. I should really just Google where to find a few more smithing stone ones. But uh, that would require me all tabbing. And that's not immersive at all. Oh. What's over there? Well, let's check what's down here first, I guess. We'll go the boring way. Oh, we'll go up there. Oh, this area? I was here. But at least there's these guys, so. Okay. No, there's dogs. I'm done. I'm dead, actually. Die. Please die. Please die. Okay. Fido's down. The amount of times I died to Fido's in this game. Way too many. Any uh, smithing stone ones? Any uh, smithing stone one owners? Maybe uh, whoever's this way has one. Clueless. Where if you were fired and expect throwing? Oh. But do you drop smithing stone ones? No. So you're useless. Oh, that guy's... Oh, the chugger chugger choo choo guy. He thinks he's a com comedian. Okay. No. Pickaxe. No, guys. Give me... Give me literally why I'm here. Give me what I'm here for. Like, I don't... I don't want to deal with any of this other dumb stuff. Like, I just want... My smithing stones, man. I go back and beat Crucible Knight with the club at this point. The end goal of this video is also oh oh maybe he has stones. Maybe he has stones. Uh um. What? Wait, stop doing one attack, man. I'm dead. Can I hit him? I feel like this guy would be dead. Okay. Okay. Now give me stones, please. <laughs> what is that? I <laughs> I need stones. Worse and breath attacks me. 
I need I need smithing stone ones. I literally need smithing stone ones. I wanna see what the rapier can do. Guys, guys. <sighs> you know, we can't all get what we want. Sometimes just gotta do what needs to be done. So let's go with the crucible night with our club. And just get it done. Alright? We get it done and this video's over. Alright? It's one last task. It's one last task, okay? Before we do that one last task, message from our sponsors. No. We're gonna go back and we're gonna spend our runes before losing them for the fifth time. And buy a stone sword key. So we can actually use that in the future for actual content that isn't me running around naked. It's actual exploration and actual cool stuff. Like I said, not me being stupid. What does Gostak have? Does he have anything that... Oh, so he sells the bandit stuff, so that's why he has the buckler. Okay. Anything here that I need? I am discovery, crafting, don't care. So I'd rather just have the stone sword key, for sure. Should I invest in something else here? Longsword, don't care. Dagger also has pretty good crit, but I just don't think we'll never need it. I should have gotten this earlier. What the hell? 130? I'm going to use that on Margaret, but... Um, well, we'll just put 1,000 souls on our body. So that we have something to lose when we fight Crucible Knight. Up the tension, alright? Oh god, we're running thin. You hear that? Not much of anything. Oh no, a drip. That's alright. Alright. One last boss. One last boss, guys. It's just one last boss. It's a pretty easy boss. You know, we can't really mess this up. Should be, uh, should be pretty straightforward. Elden Ring, a solid 11 out of 0.5. You know what I mean? It's that good. Um, I, I ironically recommend this game to anyone. Because it can be really easy if you use summons. Like, on any of like the weird duplicate fights that I just thought were just dumb and lazy. and like, You know, oh, you're going to fight two Crucible Knights at once. Lel. Like, anything like that. I just used summons. I didn't care. And, um, yeah, it just makes the game... It's not like piss easy, like, oh, I, I one shot, but it, it's a good little crutch for anyone who hasn't done it before. And like I said, you can always go and you can go and level and you just put points of strength or, or vigor, really. Getting more health is like key in this game. I got to like the mountaintop of giants and I just, I was done because I, uh, I was done because I didn't put really that much in vigor, so I literally had that happen to me, but on like a basic dog just killed me. I'm not really upset about that because we have a done him in a little bit. And uh And we know once we get him rolling, we get him rolling. I wonder if you can keep him out of his uh like wing jump face if you just keep on him. The problem is, is his tail. I think that tail is going to really, really fuck us. So I might... Uh, I won't switch to the... Because the buckler is just still so good, but... That's one. I'm going to heal after this one. Great. I'm glad I did that. I'm glad I have a chance to heal if I ever make a mistake. So if I ever make a mistake, I gotta just run really far. Yeah, that guy goes down way too fast. We did plus one our rapier, right? So maybe I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll bring out the rapier just to see how it is. Even just plus one. I, I wanted to get, obviously, some more. Did we really get no stones? Yeah, we made no progress. Yeah. We, we did not progress at all. 
<laughs> in, in that past whatever, I don't even know how much time this has been. We did not progress the weapon, uh, the amount that we needed for the weapon at all. Which is great, you know, making no progress is good progress. Alright, let's see here. Let's get in here. Let's try the plus one. Because even at plus zero, it was doing better than, uh... It was doing better than the club. Yeah, it's already at 200. Not even plus anything. Oh, you can't. Alright, so something like that, that little song and dance. Just repeat that a few times. Come on, you. Stop being a bitch. Oh, oh. you gotta keep playing like a bitch, man. You just die if you don't. Oh, he knows. I wonder if he knows. He knows that I'm going to parry him. He might. They. I really think they upped the AI quite a bit. And oh, I didn't realize he was stomping. Wasn't that much of a tell, honestly. I wonder if I can really block that. Yeah, he just has... I feel like his uh, window for doing that is really high. Oh, you can parry those. It's not really good because... Alright, I'll back off. Oh, this is actually perfect. He's gonna do that. Yeah, I feel like he's open for so long. If we keep him just doing that, we'll be alright. That was what I was worried about. That was good. Alright, you can't. Uh, that was a little risky. We don't have any left, but... Never say never. Ah, uh, well... I'd say this run's just about done. But hey, maybe we're getting insanely lucky from here on out. Maybe we don't. <laughs> Alright, we got a little bit better RNG. Uh, we understand the fight clearly a lot more now. It's whenever... It's like this. His is, his is super, like, long. I definitely think a little bit too long. Especially the tink or the tink. His jab, I think you can parry his jab. It's just devastating if you don't, so I've just been rolling out of it instead. I could also punish him on the way up, but I noticed that the rapier, he just has so much armor, it might just be worth only critical hitting. Because I notice it just kind of goes through him and doesn't hit him half the time. So... It might not be worth getting out of rhythm just to get a cheap hit off on him. Nice. We like regression. We like making progress and saying that the boss is completely easy and then dying on the first hit. It's just good. We can kill this guy. This guy is not. Literally, that, that that guy with the axe at the bottom of the mine was harder. And just far harder. As far as, like, being able to tell when he was about to swing. Because you would... 
you would parry while he was going like this, but if you didn't get him like while he was like this, like directly lined up with you, the parry just did not count. It just didn't matter. This guy is a lot more generous. Yeah, like it's a, you just, yeah, you can feel it. Nice. I got it. So he does like the stomp and I'll be super telegraphed and sometimes he just like steps, like he barely steps and there's big rocks. Like, I don't, I don't understand that. Like sometimes it's really well, like, oh, he lifts his leg and other times it's so I think that's kind of annoying. That, that's what threw me off there. Thankfully, we're dying right here, so we pick up our souls literally right there. That's perfect. Like I said, we get some good RNG where he doesn't do bullshit things, and this guy's done. There we go. Don't stomp. Don't do anything like that. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging, man. All right, you can't. You can't do that. All right, that's good. All right, we love that attack. All right, so we have to bait out a certain attack. Because if we don't, then we need to bait out a stomp attack or something. All right, so this one kind of forfeit. Wow, you can you can actually parry the and we weren't even that close to him. I like shouldn't have gone off. Alright, now we can basically parry anything of this. Anything that isn't a stomp. Like if he didn't stomp, this guy would get stomped. Or do that move. I imagine those moves aren't variable either. Glad I did that. Why do I fall for the same things? This is what I mean, though I am not smart. I'm not a smart person. Because I fall for the same things over and over again. Yeah, I can't, can't do that one. So this is a dead run. Purely because I killed it. Because I just did dumb things, which is what you'll you'll find a lot of the time. But it's always good for practice. So I don't know if I can get. Yeah, I couldn't. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, we can't do that one. Or there's a delay on it, and I'm not smart enough to figure out the delay on it. So there's a few moves that he will just kill us with if he does them. So we just pray that he doesn't do them, because learning them, yeah, who wants to learn them? I said, three in the morning, I'm not learning anything new. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, boys. All right, all right, this attempt for sure. Are they going to say seek fire, seek bloodline? Praise the guard counter. Time for parrying. Okay, everyone knows that this guy is a parry, parry joke. He's just getting shamed by the messages at his at his front door. Yeah, like I feel like I'm super early there when I do that, and it still counts. Like that, I just spammed it twice because I missed the first one. Alright, we're good. Why? Why does he get infinite attacks, man? I hate that shit. Alright, just kill me. Good. It's because I'm impatient. I'm just such an idiot. I'm so stupid 100% of the time. Like, I know I just, I can't heal. 
You can't heal. If you, if you make a mistake in this fight, you just can't heal. You have to wait for him to do a stomp or, or some slam down move. And then I insist on getting a heal. I'm just, like I said, I'm, I'm not a smart person. I'm really bad at these games. I shouldn't be doing what I'm doing, but I am going to do it because I'm going to get good. I'm getting good. I'm literally get gooding right now. This is the definition of get good. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Missing all the parries and then dying without landing a hit and all your heals still up. All right. You know you're completely out of it when... <laughs> It's like, I'm just getting worse, I'm getting more tired, and I'm just getting more delusional. And this is resulting in probably the, the best Elden Ring gameplay anyone's ever seen. Look at this man, this man will kill this boss. If I don't kill this boss before 4 in the morning, I'll circumcise his penis. Alright. 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 Go do your move. Yep, do your bit. Good. That's actually very good. I'm going to kill myself. I might not do this, boss. I'm actually so pissed right now. I just, I know I'm just being retarded and I don't want to deal with it. I've dealt with it every boss. Where I just, I'm just doing dumb things. I know I can kill it and... <sighs> yeah, I'm just being stupid. I'm just being stupid, and then that's it. It's just a shame, man. If I just had, like, like literally two more IQ, I could do so much. I just, I'm just uh, an idiot that can't press fucking left trigger. Good, he's stomping all the time. Good. I almost slammed my head on that. Yeah, I'm really good. I'm really happy that he's just using all moves that I can't parry and do anything against. It's really good, and I'm really happy about that. Because I didn't want to actually kill him or fight him or do anything, actually. I just want to uh, stand there and keep getting chain hit and stuff that I can't do anything with. That's normally how I like fighting my bosses. Okay, so let's, you know, like I said. Okay. You know, just getting one off, you just feel good, alright? The sounds, the, it's all there. And then you do this. If you ever miss the first one with this guy, you can literally just spam tap. Alright, we're in a good rhythm here. See, he's not using any dumb abilities. The more, the, the better his abilities are. Yeah. Yeah, so he tried to use a dumb ability there. I, I didn't let him. I thought he was going to stomp. I really don't know why. Now he is. I can't, can't parry that. I know we can't parry that. What? What? <laughs> what? All right. How'd that rock hit me? And then I was going like this. How did I not roll? Okay. That literally just killed me for no reason. It wasn't in the AOE. And I was spamming B. I'm still spamming it because I have PTSD. I'm literally spamming it because I died for no reason. On a perfectly fine run, that could have been it. God fucking damn it. Let's go again. Oh no, man. We're in the one time here. I don't have all night. Oh, 
Go fuck yourself. You can do it. It's when you start dragging it up. Why did I go and risk that? I really don't know. I just wanted another opening. Now it's basically every hit other than his shield and his stomp that we can just... I don't have words. I, I actually don't have words for it. I, uh, I, uh, I don't have anything to say. Really, uh, really wish I could have gotten like one more stone and uh, upgraded my weapon, but none of the mine shaft bosses uh, dropped any stones. Funnily enough. I'm done. All right, boys. You have a good night. I'm not fighting this boss. I don't care. I'll give it one more attempt. I actually, I actually just want to go to bed. I don't feel like doing this anymore. And uh, yeah, that's about it. That's that's how I feel. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to sit here for another two hours at some ungodly time in the morning fighting this boss that I've killed on another save. In the arena that I know I can beat him in, and I'm just not, because I think I ch literally because I'm really tired. <laughs> you can do those too. Okay. It's just dumb. It's I hate his stomp. It doesn't like when he stomps then you can tell, but the other one he just kicks up dirt. And it kills you instantly. Very mad. Uh, this is Dark Souls experience. You just get mad and you stay up just way too late. Just getting mad, and now you're more mad, thinking about how mad you are. And you're mad because you're bad. And you suck dick, man. You just suck fucking dick. Look at this idiot with hoarfrost axe. This person just slams ice on the ground and is killing this boss for free. And I'm sitting here doing the retard run with the character that looks like he's freaking the crimson chin but pale. Albino crimson chin. Why did I, why did I roll? Why didn't I roll? Why'd I use a full potion? Why'd I... Why'd I do any of this? I don't know. I'm done with his... I, I, I'm going to bed. 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 I'm going to bed, guys. I'm going to bed. I'm going to bed. I actually don't care. I'm spamming the. I'm spamming the home button. I'll go to bed. I might pick this up another time. I, I'm going to bed. 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 Don't care. Don't care. Actually, don't care. Don't care. See ya. Bye. Don't care. I'm not sitting here dying to stamp. I'm not. I'm not doing that. I don't care. He's a completely optional boss. I I, I want to go fight Godric or, or do something uh, fun. I, I don't care. I clicked continue. All right, we'll give him one more attempt. But that is literally it. And it's only because I'm going to alt F4. Because the game l makes you quit out twice, which is probably the biggest flaw with Elden Ring. It's trying to exit the game. It just takes fucking forever. And then Steam keeps it open for another two minutes I'm not waiting 120 seconds for Elden Ring to close and I make the same damn mistake boys
of F4. Peace.